This is Dr. Patricia Barth, and she is our unsung hero of science. We'd like to tell you about her and her achievements. She was the first African-American resident in ophthalmology at New York University. The obstacles she encountered in her life include sexism, racism, and relative poverty. She was an ophthalmologist, and ophthalmology is the diagnosis and treatment of disorders of the eye. She believed that eyesight is a basic human right. She was the first to realise that near her home in Harlem, New York, black patients were almost twice as likely as white patients to be blind due to a lack of access to ophthalmic care. She created an area called community ophthalmology, which combines aspects of public health, community medicine and clinical ophthalmology to offer primary care to populations who weren't receiving it. They test vision, screen for cataracts, glaucoma and other threatening eye conditions. And they also identify children who need glasses. But this is only some of the highly important work that they do. A cataract is when the lens of the eye goes cloudy, typically in old age, due to metabolic waste accumulating in the lens of the eye. We find it inspirational that she created the laser phaco probe to treat this condition. Today, the device is used worldwide and improves the use of lasers to treat cataracts. It quickly and nearly painlessly dissolves the cataract, then irrigates and cleans the eye and permits the easy insertion of a new lens. She was, among other things, the first African-American resident in ophthalmology in the United States, the first female chair of ophthalmology in the United States, and the first African-American female doctor to receive a medical pattern. And yet, we know very little about her, and that is why she is our unsung hero of science.